Okay? The real Jesus of the Bible tells you it's repent or perish. He doesn't play games. God doesn't play favorites. You either want to follow me or you want to serve yourself for your little finite vapor of life. And then you'll be cut off and you'll be tormented for the rest of your eternity. It's one way or the other. Which is eternity, right? Eternity in hell is not, doesn't end. <laughs> it's forever. Just like paradise in heaven with Jesus, it never ends either. So I'm, I'm choosing paradise. I'm choosing death to me now for God's glory. Instead of giving glory to the Blue Jays and the Raptors and the Maple Laps and all the stupid, vain things of the world, the trivial pursuit pleasures of the world, I'm giving glory to the God of heaven and earth, Amen. Jesus Christ. Amen. Jesus Christ said, I'm the way, I'm the truth, I'm the life. Jesus said, believe on me. Yeah, because Beyonce is a high-class hooker. She's a prostitute. But she gets paid lots of money, so people think she's not a prostitute. That's so true. The only difference between her and the girls on Church Street is she makes way more money than they do. Really? How does a young girl use her as a role model when she's only selling her body for set for money? She's also extremely talented. But she's a ta what is that? What is that? is that talent? Does that talent work in heaven? Is that talent? What the, because she's got a right. so why wouldn't she use her incredible voice given to her by God by Jesus Christ to glorify him instead of glorifying herself and wickedness you know that Beyonce wears the goat head ring she wears goat head shirts that's the goat of Mendes promoting Satan yeah, the Catholic church is the Catholic church is the whore yeah the Catholic church is the horror. Read Revelation 17. Hallelujah. The Catholic Church has murdered 50 to 80 million Christians. We have it on DVD if you'd like one. The Catholic Church is the older version of Christianity. No, actually the Catholic Church wasn't started until the 5th century officially. But they lie to you and tell you that the apostles of Jesus were Catholics. They weren't Catholics. Technically Jesus wasn't Christian either. He was You're right. Jesus actually never created Christianity. Christ means Messiah in Greek. And Greek was the dominant language, so that's why we have Christianity, which seems like another religion, but it's not. I'm a Messiah I eat if I follow Jesus. You're a Messiah I eat if you follow Jesus. I just want to make sure that you don't say anything offensive because we're just trying to... What's up, brother? Long time. How are you? I just want to make sure you don't say anything offensive because... Not right now, brother. We're just having a discussion. Okay? Love you, bro. Are you okay? What's the matter, man? Be a good example, okay, bro? Little kids watching. Oh, yeah. Love you, bro. Love so, I don't want to fight with you either. But what we want, you know what it is? It's communication. Yeah, yeah. And they don't know any better. They're talking that way. But, but, but if I say, yeah. no, but people push stuff on me all day. Like, see, that's pushed on children all day long. But if they're pushing that, can I do the same? We're living in a free country, right? Really? But they're pushing clothing that glorifies sex and loose women and immodest women. Well, they're also pushing women who are a size 2 as opposed to women who are a size 16. Okay, but I mean, come on, I, you have a conscience, right? You know what things are right and wrong. And you, what we do is when we start calling evil good, that God, the Bible says, woe unto you. Really? Evil is subjective. What do you think about pedophiles and daycares? Well, you're here tomorrow? Right. You're here tomorrow? Of course. So then, so is there truth that's, that's uh, impartial to man? I love this place. Amen. I love you people. I love you too. I'm lifted. I'm lifted. Yes, yes. Love you guys. Love you, guys. Jesus, so tomorrow. Yes. Love you, buddy. God bless. Love you, buddy. I'm happy. I'm happy. Yeah. As far as I'm concerned, the Christian religion is about not being judgmental and about not... Love you, honey. Okay, what's your job? It's not your job to judge the people. It's God's job. Okay, hold on, Neil. What, is it, what, is, what do you think Jesus meant when he said in John 7, 24, if you judge, judge righteously. But I, I'm, not, I'm not judging you. I'm only declaring what Christ has said, and he is the judge. As far as I'm aware, Jesus never said anything about homosexuality. Yeah. Really? So, so the New Testament and the New. Can I read it to you? Would you like me to read it? Okay, let, one, one at a time. You want me to read it to you? I'll just read Romans. I just wanted to say that just don't try not to say anything too offensive because... I try not to. There are some people who are going to push their stuff on you. Yeah, yeah. It's not fair for you to do the same. No, it is very fair. If, if, okay. So Jesus was wrong. The Bible's wrong. Personally, 
I think that what you're is. preaching hey, with that sign and with telling people that their lifestyle is wrong, I think that's wrong. Okay, so then you, you believe Jesus was wrong then? Because that's all from the Bible. I guess so. Okay, so that's fair. You have a right to choose, but you're... I think, every, I think everyone should be equal, and I think everyone should be entitled to their own opinion. Well, don't sear your conscience, because you know you were raised Christian. You know what Jesus said. I'm not Regardless of whether you... I'm not Christian, though. No, you were, though. I was raised Christian, but I don't... I'm not yeah, you don't follow Christ. Okay, well, one question. If truth is subjective, do you believe there's absolute truth? You said it's subjective, so you don't... Uh, no, I don't. I okay, believe in everyone's so now, opinion. That is critical because you believe in evolution. Truth. No, I'm saying that's no, my opinion. Saying, you're refuting absolute truth with the absolute statement. Yeah, that doesn't make sense. If my truth is you're right, if my truth is 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 to kill you in five minutes, does that make it true? No, I'm saying that I didn't say that what you're saying isn't true. I'm saying that I personally do not. Where do you get your standard between right and wrong? I'm not saying. I'm just saying. It's, I'm just saying it's not right. I know, but I'm asking you. Where? For, Forget about the Bible. Where do you I get your standard from right or wrong? My standard for true, for my standard for right and wrong is if you're hurting someone else, then it's wrong. Okay, but with so God. Some, but let me just finish because for a man and a man to be together, a woman and a woman to be together, for example, that's not hurting anyone. Well, it is. That's you think, your opinion, though. If you think that's hurting, if you think that's hurting them, themselves, that's their own business. So you're putting yourself above God, who people, wrote the scriptures. What people do, what people do in their own Where houses the is their business. From? No, but it's not, sister, because they don't want to live in darkness. Darkness. They want to take their darkness and parade it in the light. But what if they don't want to do that? That's what I'm saying. They do, sister. What world do you live in? Have you gone to Church Street? Have you seen the the, the, the poles like this, covered with big buff guys, strap dildos to their bodies, and little kids. There's schools and daycares around there. Should little kids be seeing that? It's it's not hatred. See, you perceive the you perceive God's love and and commands as hatred. No, you're not. All of us know. What are you saying? That we should learn. I had it. I didn't. Yes, I know. No, because that means that it's one person who should learn to accept everyone. Everyone. God bless, brother. Grab some DVDs. Grab some DVDs. They're free. Grab some. So are you saying? So you're saying? You and your lady can watch the DVDs, brother. Gay or lesbian? That you would disown them? So you would condemn your own children to hell? I'm sorry, but I find that a little disgusting. Your morality takes you to hell. So where do you get where do you get tested in life? So life, you you think you're a good person? Do you think you're good? They come from the top. Really? So so then Jesus was a nut job. So he died for you in vain because you were good. Sorry, Jesus, you didn't have to die for me because I'm a good person. I'm not saying I'm the best person ever. I'm not saying that I have never done anything. Well, you just said you're good, as if. I'm saying I I think I'm a pretty. You're either good or bad. Okay, let's let's go let's go. Hold on, 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 hold on. Let's do the truth test. Why do you need religion as the high point for accepting? Listen, we don't need religion. Slow. Let me talk. Okay, let me talk. That's your opinion. Okay. I never, I totally Let's do the truth that. test. You said you're, you think you're a good person. Let's see how good you are, okay? Have you ever lied in your life? And I'm in the same boat, everything I'm asking you. I was going to say, have you ever lied? Yes. Okay, so yes. we're on the same page. We're, what is that? What do we call ourselves if we've lied it once? Make me a bad person. Just, just stick with me here for a second. Okay, fine. What does that make us if you and I have lied before? Liars. It's human being. It's human beings. Don't, don't, don't just rationalize. Just go by definition. Harsh definition. If we've lied, we're our definition of ourselves, we are liars. Doesn't matter if it's once or ten or a hundred. Okay. If you have you ever stolen something, taken something that's not yours? No. Never in your life. You just told me you were a liar. How can I believe you? <laughs> so you're saying when you were three years old, you've never lied to your parents? I, I said I have. I said oh, every. Yeah, but you can't hold that against you for the rest no, of no, your no. life. No, no, no. Hold on a second. You're jumping. You're running ahead of what I'm saying. Let me. You're trying to twist my words. I'm not twi How am I twisting oh your words? God. We asked. I asked you if you've lied. Again, you said yes. So that, by definition, means you're a liar. You've lied. Well, you're don't so, don't, don't sir, cling to mercy and sir, forginess sir, before you look sir, at your well, sin. Well, respect, then you're a liar as well, so why I, should we believe what you're saying? I, so we'll okay, 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 fair enough. That's a good, you're great. Let's see how you're playing the game back on me. But I'm the one that, that's on the street doing this for a, 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 all, 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 every weekend. So hear what I'm saying. Go with me for a second. I don't hate you. I, I love every person, whether they hate me or not. I know that I see because God touched my life. I have a testimony of God touching me, not religion. I left religion. I actually, most Christians hate me today because I called them out. Just what happened to Jesus? Jesus called the fake Christians in the first century, and they hated them. 
They killed him, okay? So hear what I'm saying. You and I have lied before, so we're liars. I'm sure that you've taken something in your life that wasn't yours. Okay, well that's, that. I, I believe, I, I don't believe that, but that's okay. We'll say that you never, have you ever lusted after someone in your mind that you're not committed to in your heart? Amen. Never. Never. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm demisexual, that's what that means, is that I cannot have a sexual connection with someone unless I'm in a relationship with them. Okay, that's fine. That's good. Okay. Uh, have you ever, have you ever, um, have you ever um, dishonored your parents? Uh, in what sense? Uh, when they asked you to do something, you didn't do it. Okay, so then you've broken that commandment. So, so now that we see that you and I are guilty, because I've done all the, I've broken all the commandments. You and I are guilty by the law, and the law for, without forgiveness is harsh. Okay? If, for instance, see the police officer there, if, if it was illegal to run across the street at 1 o'clock to save a child, and you did it because there was a child there, which is smart, at the time when you can break the law because it makes sense, okay? If, 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 that, if we broke the law, then we're guilty of the law. We, we have to be punished, okay? We need, justice has to be served, right? Like if someone murdered your family, you would want justice to be served. Forget about mercy and forgiveness. Then we see that we're guilty according to God's holy law, which is so harsh. But this has okay? nothing to do with me not being a good person. Just because you, uh, people have made mistakes in their life doesn't mean that they're not good people. So you, you totally don't th believe in the Bible? You think it's garbage, it's a waste of time? I don't think time. it's garbage. I think there are lots of good things to be learned. Oh, but you just don't want to submit to what the whole thing. I don't think it should be used to preach hatred. That's what I'm saying. So, I'm, just, I'm just saying it shouldn't be used. So you're just ignoring God and you're living a selfish life. I think it should be used to preach equality and love and it, No, 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 no. You can't take what God has said and make it into your little potato head, Jesus. I can prove everything that comes out of this mouth in the scripture. You can't prove your homosexual love, which is not love. Really? So then we can't use anything. 